<clears throat> hi good day today i'm going to be teaching how to uncomponent a component i don't know what to call it but um i'm going to make a component we have actually been complaining of this issue that when you have a component a main component you are really not uh, like you are not able to change it back to its previous state so now I'm going to try to make this a component and you know now that I've made it a component if I want to remove this component layer on it I just drag out the the child this is the child item A when I drag it out you see that is no longer a variant or anything so this one I can always delete it but 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 what if you have an item A then item B which is also a component and then you combine as variants you know that in here you have previously defined components that were com combined as variants so if you drag out one you really can't remove this from it so what I would do you can try to remove this item A from from the uh, what's it called from the component and then it will make you the component but one method that I've hacked is that uh, <clears throat> let me go to this place one method that I've hacked is so here we have a component of so many variants someone did this and I'm trying to correct the file so someone did this and then he has so many variants which were components before you combine them as variants so here because they are from frames, if you drag all the variants out, you get new components. Can you see that all of them are components now? So the method I hacked is when you have all these components now, you know because they are frames, you really can't drag out all the elements inside these frames. So you combine, you, you don't combine, sorry. If you combine as variants, you are back to this point that we drag them out of. So you make them component again create component so when you do this it gives you this new component 3 and then this new component 3 now has elements that you can drag out of the component and this is it so here you can always detach instance of all of them detach instance and here you go you have your fresh frames and I don't know this works until Figma gives us the normal, easy way. This is what I'm going to be using. So I'm glad you enjoyed it. Thank you. Thank you.